Hello viewers, welcome to my channel at Easy Surveys, where I make survey practices easier and educative. Here in this video, I want to quickly show everyone on how to incorporate the AI into AutoCAD software. So I'll be making use of this AI, the DeepSeek, as well as the Pi AutoCAD in Visual Studio. All right. So I'll be making use of the AI, the Visual Studio. So you are going to get this particular software, Visual Studio. So the Pi AutoCAD is an extension in Visual Studio and that is what is going to aid the automation of any jobs you want to do in AutoCAD. All right. Then you open your AutoCAD, which is the major software in the course of this video. So you are expected to be in a new work environment and you get this three set of application ready. The AI, the DeepSeek, the Visual Studio, which has the extension of the Pi AutoCAD that will aid the automation in the AutoCAD software. All right. So firstly, let's get started with the DeepSeek AI. So, right. so in my region here in Nigeria, we go by two sizes or dimension of plots. It's either you go with 50 by 100 or you go with 60 by 120 in feet all right so i want to see what is the area of 50 feet by 100 feet in square meters and what is the area of 60 feet by 120 feet in square meters so let's get started so then you type this question could you create a land parcel 50 feet by 100 feet with area in square meters label on it using pi autocad that will show results in my autocad then you click on send so you make sure your system is connected to an active internet so that you can have your results accurately generated therefore it is going to generate a python script that you are to copy and paste under your pi autocad in your visual studio then you copy the python script generated you minimize then you come to your visual studio then you come to file you come to new file you click on that therefore here you give it a file name the new file you want to print so i'm just going to give this autocad dot small letter py so that is the python extension dot py then you click on this create new file it is going to direct you to a folder so make sure you create a folder on your desktop then you navigate to that particular folder so that this particular file name that you are creating now under the visual studio code will be saved there then you click on create file so you are going to see this window popping up all right then you come to view then you scroll down to terminal so it is going to give you an extension okay below therefore this autocad.py this is where you are going to paste the command of the python script generated then you go back you copy the generated python script from the deepseek ai then you come here right click then you paste the particular command so you can see we have from 1 to 44 uh commands okay scripted commands in python okay so you make sure that this is actually created successfully before you actually run it all right therefore i'm going to attach this python command under the video description in case you want to try it out yourself all right to achieve the same result you make sure your autocad is already opened all right then, then you click on run python file so you see it process below here then you see land parcel created successfully with area label then you open your autocad if you can't see anything you click on zoom extent so you can see here that the area in square meters for 50 by 100 feet is 464.52 square meters so that's just it you can see that the area is 464.52 square meters that is the standard square meters for 50 feet by 100 feet in my region all right so when you are done confirming this you can choose to open a new work environment for that of 60 feet by 120 feet 
to check the area in square meters so all you have to do is to come back to the visual studio then you edit the length in feet so this time around this is 120 then this is 60 all right so that is just all you have to do you don't need to come back to the uh deepseek ai to generate that you just need to edit the width and the length which is in feet then you click on run python file so you see it here land passive return successfully with area label then you can come back to your autocad then you click on zoom extent so you can see here it is larger and you can see the area in meter square which is square meters it is 668.91 so the area in square meters for 60 feet by 120 feet is 668.91 meters square while that of 50 feet by 100 feet is 464.52 meters square so, so you can see how ai is really making survey easier and very interesting all right so so lastly let me just quickly do this okay i want to plot coordinate of a four corner uh, parcel to see how the dimension is in AutoCAD without me imputing the coordinates one by one in the command line or running scripts from notepad or from other sources okay so what I just want to do is to automate my plotting in AutoCAD so you just come back to your DTIC AI then you type this question so you make sure that your question is well constructed for the ai to easily generate a pi autocad script for you so this is the question could you plot this set of coordinates p1 bracket you open a bracket x equals you put the instance of that coordinate of points then a space y equals the coordinate of the nothings then you close the bracket comma then you do the same for p2 you do the same for p3 do the same for p4 so i have those four corner that i want to plot all right then using my autocad that will show results in my autocad then you just click on send so you wait for a while it is going to generate a pi autocad command that will automate your plotting without running script without plotting using any manual method at all So it is done. You can see how fast and easy it is. So all, all you have to do is to copy the Python script to plot coordinates. You minimize. Come to your Visual Studio. Make sure you open a new work environment. All right. Come to your Visual Studio. Then you can now erase this previous Python script. All right. Stay under the new file. You right click. Then you paste the new uh, generated Python script. Then you click on Run Python file. So below here you can see it coordinates plotted successfully in AutoCAD. Then you just come to your AutoCAD new work environment. If you can't see anything, you click on zoom extent. So here is the generated automated parcel that is plotted based on the coordinates and imputed. So you can just choose to check the ID of the coordinate to make sure it is at the right position. So you can see this is for one of the points and you can see the coordinate here. And that is how majorly I use AI in automating a whole lot of things in my survey jobs. If you find this video helpful, please do well to hit on the subscribe icon and turn on the notification bell on this channel to keep getting first hand tutorial. So if you need me to run a video on how to do your setup for Pi AutoCAD and get your installation of the Visual Studio code, please drop your interest under the comment section i would love to hear from you to get encouraged to do that thank you see you in the next video